can use Voxit Reader to view and read PDF files, but if you want to be able to write PDF files from documents like Word documents or Excel spreadsheets, you're going to need another piece of software, and that's called Qt PDF Writer. And I have the website up here, C-U-T-E PDF. Uh, they have a download here. It's a free download, so I'll click that. Save the file and install it. And installing it is very simple. Just click Next, accept the agreement, and click Install. Okay. And now to use Qt PDF, all you have to do is open up any software. And the way it works is when you go to print from any piece of software that allows printing, instead of selecting the printer that you may regularly use, you just select the Qt PDF printer. So I'll go to this Word document and I'll say print. And then instead of selecting my regular printer that's on my desktop, I'll select Qt PDF Writer, say OK, and it's going to ask me where I want to save the PDF, so I'll save it here onto my desktop, and I'll put a file name in and click in. It will be converted to a PDF document. So if I go back to the folder where I open this file, you'll notice there's a new PDF that's named the same as the Word document. And if I double click it, it opens up in the Foxit PDF reader or whatever PDF reader that you have set to your default. And you can see it looks just like a Word document. It actually looks a little better. It, it makes the type look better and stuff. And if there were links in there, uh, they're clickable. Close that down. So not only works out of Word or Excel, which you would expect, but it works with pretty much any other software. Another thing that you can do with a PDF writer that's really nice is print anything from any application that prints. So for instance, I have directions up on this uh, website, it's Yahoo Maps, and if I wanted to get their printable directions that they use, I can click here and it puts them up and it's in a format that they provide, but I actually like them the way they are here. So if I just say file print and I select the Qt PDF Writer as my printer, click OK. It will ask me where I want to save it and I'll say give it a title and do that and it prints. Then if I go to my folder, here's that PDF I just created open it up and it has all my driving directions, has my map, etc. Uh, one of the places that this is really nice is uh, if you buy stuff off the internet and you print off some invoices, it's really nice you can save the invoices, just save them on your hard drive somewhere and then there are PDF files which you can search for later and things like that. So that's always 